Hey guys, I just want to quickly demonstrate uh, something I've been messing around with here in Lightroom. See, a lot of the things that Lightroom can do now, I am just starting to figure out that they even exist. So uh, some of the things that I used to do in Photoshop, uh, apparently I can now do in Lightroom. And here's one of the things that uh, I actually don't do uh, a lot of um, retouching in Photoshop, uh, especially you know anything really intense. Uh, but I just thought that this was this was pretty interesting. Uh, we're going to start with this picture of Danielle. Uh, now I think the picture looks great just as it is, but what I want to do is experiment a little bit with uh, what we might do with the eyes here in Lightroom with these some of these newer tools. Uh, and they just make a lot of the stuff um, very convenient, very easy to do. You don't have to you don't have to punch out into Lightroom. I mean, into Photoshop uh, to get some of this stuff done. All right, let's just start here with a little uh, eye work. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to mask up, just brush in right here and a little bit right here. See, I'm not going to go all the way to the edges of the eyes. I don't want this to look weird. I'm also not going to get into the whites of the eyes. Uh, and you'll see why in a second. But let me go ahead and just bring the exposure up a little bit. See, I could go crazy. I could go all children of the corn here, but I just want to bring it up just a little bit. See, bring it down, bring it up. Just put it to, I don't know, something like this, right about there. i just go ahead and, and quickly take a look and see what that looks like. Okay, this is why what I, you know, I don't want to do is just take it up too crazy high, okay? Uh, because, like I said, if I do, you know, it starts looking a little, little weird. And I've seen a lot of people uh, where they do that, but I just don't like it. So bring it down to here. And um, just to just to explain why I don't want to do, I mean, you can probably figure it out from what I just said, but just to, to kind of let you know why I don't want to mess around with the whites. Uh, let's just, let's just say that we, we covered this whole area here like this instead of just the, the, uh, inside of the eyes and the eye color. Uh, let's just say let's just say that we did that and we went like this. I mean that to me that's just too much. So let's go back. You see? It's just it's a little too much. It's just it so we're what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna remove that and that just looks a lot more natural. But let's go ahead and do the uh so one thing Go like this. Just pop that little bit of light in. Next, next, let's let's do something a little fun. I'm going to bring the exposure down like this, and I'm going to just draw in a little bit of eyeliner. too much. I mean, I could go really dark, bring it to like this, something, something silly. Let's just keep it a little, little subtle, a little tasteful, and then come back out. And there we have it. I think we're done. So we have this. Let's see what it looks like with these gone. So we have this, which I think looks great, but again, we're just messing around a little bit doing that. And pull it back, take a look at it like this, and look at it like this. Yeah, I think that looks pretty cool. 